So I'm having one of those days where uh, real estate really isn't flying today. So uh, I'll show you what I do. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see the world in action. What we can be. Life with no distractions. Small ice cap, please. Uh, make it with chocolate milk for me. That's it. Thank you. Hardest struggles in real estate is actually staying motivated. Um, nobody cares about you, to be honest with you. It's real life. Real estate's very competitive. Uh, a lot of times you're hanging out with associates and other realtors, uh, and they're your they're your competition. So uh, you're hanging out with your enemy all the time, trying to be buddy buddy. And like I said, they don't care about you they're after the real estate just as much as you are. A good way to look at it would be there's a hundred fishermen and they're all going to the same fishing hole and uh, there's only so many fish in the in the fishing hole. So uh, same deal here. There's only so many deals. There's uh, that many realtors and it's a lonely business. It's a very competitive business. I love the competitiveness of this business. But one thing that does happen is uh, you can have a down day. Uh, something negative could have happened to your business or one of your deals. And it's how you deal with that. So uh, today I'm going to show you how I deal with a down day. So over the past year, this is this has been going on now uh, over a year, maybe uh, maybe fourteen months or so, and it's it's a real estate deal uh, that I magically put together. You need to understand that when I do real estate, I do a lot of residential, like just homes, uh, resale homes, and uh, new builds uh, and condos. While I've been doing those, I've been getting a little bit of history on development and new subdivisions. Well luck would have it that I could put a developer with a builder and try to do a development deal. Well, that's what we're sitting next to right here. That big kind of dead end caution sign here behind me is right in front of the deal that I put together. And like I said, when I'm having a down day, uh, something's not happening right in real estate or your board. Uh, a lot of times I find myself sitting here and waiting but at the same time, getting motivated about all you have to do is put one or two things together. Uh, it could be, uh, you know, a nice little house and a nice little family, or it could be a developer and a builder. Uh, if both groups are liking what they see, uh, you could do a deal. So here I am in front of the biggest real estate transaction I've ever been a part of. Millions of dollars worth of real estate, um, well over $100,000 in commission, that could be earned if this deal goes together. So like I said, I like to come here, remind myself where I started and where I'm at now and looking at past deals that have happened and then looking at this current deal. Um, it's, it's agreed to. Uh, there's tons of documents that have been signed, uh, a lot of back and forth. Ultimately, we've agreed to everything except for one thing, so we do have a, com uh, a condition right now in this deal that we're just waiting to get met. Once that deal or once that, um, once that condition is met, the deal is what we'd like to call firm, which means we're just waiting for the closing date, which means I will get paid. So again, just standing here, sitting here with uh, a little treat to drink my sorrels and in front of a dead end sign uh, that's in front of a farmer's field. I don't know if you can see anything there. Doesn't look like much now, but if my deal goes together, this could be uh, by far and away the biggest deal I've ever done. So 
that's it. That's what I do on a down day. Sometimes you'll find me here uh, drinking away my sorrows and thinking about where I started, uh, the years that have gone by, the tough deals, the good deals, the easy deals, the big deals, and this one obviously being the biggest one of all if it comes together. So um, anyway, guys, I hope this uh, helps motivate you uh, in your real estate career and or uh, get you thinking about getting into the business, man. It is a really, really cool business. I would have never thought when I started that you, I might be in amongst a deal like this worth six million dollars that's crazy six million dollars and little old me is putting it together unbelievable so uh, i hope that helps you guys i uh, hope you have a powerful day we'll see you at the next video and if you did like this video please give it a thumbs up down there and uh, hit that subscribe button help me get my channel growing as big as it needs to get all right guys take care bye for now